testing, 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 what is good guys? You already know it's your girl King going back at you with another freaking YouTube video, man. Out here in the streets of LA. I don't know what type of neighborhood I'm in. I don't know nothing. I can dead ass get robbed over here. But you know what? We'll get robbed together, okay? But we're not gonna put that negativity in the air. We're gonna just continue to do what we're gonna do. So basically I'm on my way to his little mixer at my job or whatever. Well, it's not at my job. It's like at a bar near my job. And I'm gonna go see what it's about. I'm not necessarily dressed for the occasion. I have on basically swim shorts and a white tee, but they're not swim shorts. They're like shorts that could be swim shorts. White tee, some sneakers in my fanny pack. Like, I just got off the plane a couple of hours ago. So, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do. I should've took a shower, but I'm not gonna take a shower because I knew I was gonna sweat. So, I still gotta wait for my bed to come in. If you didn't see my last recent video, I was talking about how I ordered a bed. If I didn't tell you, I ordered a bed. I didn't show y'all that I went into the store and got a bed because I had so much stuff in my hand. I didn't wanna bring out my camera. I didn't wanna be a weirdo, but that's why we're here, okay? And it is hot. It's freaking heck out here, bro. It's like a dead ass heat wave going on, so. I need to get myself some water. I'm on my way to the train station. I don't know how these trains work. I'm very scared to try this out, but I gotta do it. I really should get those scooter shit. Like, I'm scared to try it out and like bust my fucking ass. So I'm gonna wait until my roommate, when he comes home, I'm gonna see if he'll ride with me. And yeah, because it's hot. I just, I don't want to walk. You know what I'm saying? And I have to walk. Because I have to be there. Because I got to come back home. To get my mattress. And. Yeah. But this neighborhood. It looks okay. I see a barbershop right here. I don't know what this shit's about. Oh. Oh no. It's a whole different vibe out here, bro. Whole different vibe. Can I cross? I don't think I can cross. I'm about to put the camera away because I'm hot and I'm melting, nigga. The next day. I don't know if you guys can see. This light is beating, bro. Oh my god, this light really is beating damn I look good man if y'all think I look good comment down in the comment section below look at these pretty brown eyes pretty brown eyes pretty brown eyes feel me what is good, guys? It's the next day from yesterday's vlog. I didn't... All right, let me tell you what happened. Yesterday, I had to basically link up with my coworkers. Like, they was having, like, some event on my job. I didn't really get sit down and tell you guys why I actually moved out here. So, this is what I'm going to be doing. As you can see, I'm in my room right now. It's pretty empty. Don't worry. It's going to get full. My bed and everything is coming today. You guys are going to see that. You're going to see the journey. All my stuff is basically, like that way you know what i'm saying but um yeah <clears throat> hold on all right cool now we in here all right so basically i moved out here to pursue you know the whole youtube dream the the acting dream so that's why i'm talking to y'all because y'all gonna help me y'all gonna help me get to where i need to be man as long as y'all support and you know share my videos bro this is the time man this is what i came out here for so hopefully y'all rock out with me so basically yesterday i have i still work a nine to five um 
my job had an event, not necessarily an event, but they was they linked up at some brewery, some bar or whatever, and everybody was like, I'm a little meet and greet, so I get to meet my coworkers. They already had like two events before I even got out here, so I kind of missed those. So um, it was like from three to five, I left my house around like three. Then I had to get on a train took me like maybe 44 minutes to get there. So it's around where I work. So whatever that is, it's gonna take me like an hour to get to work. So I know how to maneuver that. So that's great. Um, what else? So it took me an hour to get down there. I was nervous because I, I'd be nervous to take the trains in New York City because people are crazy. Like, like I just, you know, I be, thinking of, you know, always the worst things possible because life is real and shit happens. So there was this crazy guy on the train talking to himself and I didn't have my phone out, I didn't have my AirPods in. I didn't, I only had my phone out when I had to see, uh, when, when I was getting off on the stops and I already knew what stop I was getting off of, so I was good in that aspect. So I'm moving into a new city. I don't know what these areas is like. I don't know where I'm at. So I'm not just quick to be pulling out my phone, pulling out my camera because I don't know where I'm at, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to have to shake nobody. Speaking of, I got to order me a, um, a taser. Remind me, order a taser. Because if I got to tase somebody, somebody will get motherfucking tased. But, um, yeah. So, my first night in L.A., it wasn't too bad. But let me continue. So, we were at the bar. It was nice. We mingled. I met some people. I got some numbers. I came back home, and I called the mattress place, and they told me that they when they called me i wasn't there or some something like that i gave them the wrong number or something and i said well what's the number that i give you they said that i put in two eight something that's a lie because i ended up changing it backspacing but whatever because on the invoice it says two three zero two eight three and i don't know why they didn't look at that but okay supposedly they're coming at um 11 o'clock it's already 11 13 so i should get in the shower you know what i'm saying to get myself ready so when I get here, I could do that. And then I kind of want to do a reaction video for you guys. My lips look dry. I got to get some Blick Stacks because Carmax. Who uses Carmax? Nobody. But anyway, um, I came home. I knocked out. And it's crazy because you can never say that you're too good or, you know, better than somebody else. Because the first time in my life, I slept on the floor. First time ever in my life. Like, not also no sleepover shit on some... I had to sleep on the floor because my mattress didn't come and I, was, I wasn't gonna get an air mattress because it would have costed me around the same price. Like I paid like $179 for an actual mattress and a bed spring. So eventually when I get a bed, bed is, you know, I ain't really gotta worry about that. So that's what's happening. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm trying to think, I can't really think right now. So I slept on the floor. Humbly, you know what I'm saying? Thank God I bought blankets. It was rough. It was hard. My back hurts, you know what I'm saying? But, so, you know, you had to do what you got to do. And it was a very humbling experience, I tell you that much. Very, very humbling. I didn't necessarily unpack my bags because I have nowhere to put stuff. Like, I'm going to be living out of my bag most of the time. But I'm probably going to put, like, my sneakers and my stuff in the closet and, like, hang stuff up if it could be hung up. Um... Today, I want to, I definitely want to go to Target, maybe get me some food, because I was hungry as fuck. My pizza box is what the camera is sitting on right now, because I had some pizza, but I need to get food so I can make something, maybe small snack shit, even Lunchables. I need some water, like, because I was just thirsty last night, and I just, if I would have some water bottles or some Gatorade or something, like, I don't want to spend too much money in the store because i got to be able to make it back. And I don't work until, like, the 18th. And I still got to pay rent for the first of the month. So, yeah. This is going to be a different experience. So, your girl moved out to L.A. with no money. Not necessarily, like, no money, but, you know, not like those YouTubers or people that come out here with, like, mad followers and then they have bread stocked up, like... I don't want I'm I'm gonna use the title. I came out here with a dollar and a dream. So that's it. You know what I'm saying? Like it's gonna be a dope experience. Like that's why I really wasn't vlogging yesterday. And the sun be melting my camera. Like it's hard to vlog out here sometimes if it's not cool. But it was like a heat wave yesterday. 
so it was hella hot you know what i'm saying that's why like don't worry i'm gonna be vlogging guys i know i say this all the time but i am where i need to be so y'all have to see this experience through my pretty brown eyes <laughs> you know what i'm saying um i'm basically starting a series it's gonna be a playlist where it's uh moving to la so it's gonna be what i do through la if you ever want to find the vlogs or don't know where to find them listen this is a vlog slash reaction channel but mostly going to be vlogging channel my sneaker channel is in the link description box below cypher gear anybody that ordered any cypher gear listen my mom has the orders all the stuff is at the house so i'm going to find a way for you guys to get the orders that ordered stuff at my job um if anybody ordered anything recently i'll be able to ship it to you because now I have an address to ship it to you from. But it won't be my address. Be I don't know how to get my POX box from one place to another. I'm going to see how that works. But, um, yeah. That was my first night in LA. It was a very different experience. Like, it wasn't a bad experience. It was different, but it wasn't bad. I miss my niggas. Like, it's just weird because I can't just go to the corner store what I want. I just can't, you know, I just can't go to anything close. Everything closes early out here. Like, clubs, they say shut down at like 2 o'clock. You know, in New York, everything stay open 24-7, goddamn damn near. But I might be like a party person like that. They said, you know, you start partying around like 10 o'clock here, and then you end it around like 2. So that's around my speed, to be honest. My old ass don't want to do a lot of shit. But, yeah, man, I'm trying to, you know, collab with a lot of YouTubers. I'm trying to link... Um, yeah, I'm trying to bust, I'm trying to link, yo, every YouTuber that I watch, I'm trying to link with, you know what I'm saying, like, I watch her every single day, so it's like, I might as well, I'm trying to become friends, not really friends, I guess you could say associates, business partners, whatever y'all want, I'm trying to meet DDG, Todd of God, Davin Nicole, Abby, Doug, Chino, Flight, I'm trying to bust Flight's ass, it's a ball, you know what I'm saying, Trey Harris is out here too, so I'm gonna link up with him most likely. Trap Trev is out here, so I'm gonna link up with him most likely. Those are the two people that I've been like speaking to, so. <clears throat> this vlog is about to go up. The one that I just did yesterday, we are gonna see kind of what I did yesterday, but you know, me getting here in the process. So, yeah, I had to make a vlog. I had to record something because I felt like I wasn't doing what I was supposed to do, what I came here for, you know what I'm saying? Um, comment down in the comment section below if you guys want me to do a house tour. Um, I'll obviously do a room tour when it becomes a room. Right now, it's just a room. Empty room. <laughs> like, I guess I could do an empty room tour. If you want an empty room tour, let me know, and then I'll do, like, a house tour. Um, I don't know if I'm, I can. I gotta make sure I ask my roommates, because I do live with two other people. I live with two guys. Manny and Mike. They cool. Well, I only met Manny, but Mike... I don't know. I don't know if I'm at, but if you guys want to keep up with me, I've been on Snapchat heavy. I'm going to be on Instagram more. If you want me to be on Instagram posting more pictures, you need to be active. So have your notifications turned all the way on. Of course, I'm on Twitter 24-7 tweeting what I'm doing like no other. But Snapchat, I've been on Snapchat hella heavy. I don't know why. I just be, I think it's because, I don't know. People watch my Instagram story more, I think. But Snapchat is just like so convenient for me because I just like it better. I don't know. It's a thing. But guys, I'm out of here. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why I should title this video. Because, yeah. First night in LA, I slept on the floor. That sounds good. That sounds dramatic. That sounds clickbaitable. <laughs> Man, I love you guys. Go follow me on my social media. Give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down in the comment section below. If you watch this video all the way through, I want you to comment down. Mod is what you make it. <clears throat> M-O-D. M-O-D is what you make it. That's because I'm looking at my mod pizza box. But just comment down so I know that you watch this video all the way through. I love you guys. Peace of happiness. Make sure you guys stay black. Oh.